Hey guys, it's Mr. Ray, your WeTV Digital Correspondent. Now let's get into this week's Sisters-in-Law. I told you y'all was gonna love this show. Shade in the first degree. Now, Jolanda knew what she was doing when she brought T.A. around. She's a young lawyer. She had a lot going for her. She has, you know, a husband. She works for the NAACP. She's working on her own court cases. She's the type of chick that can give a girl like Rhonda, who might be a little insecure, a run for her money. Hi, good. Nice to see you. I wanted you two to meet each other. My goal is to bring T.A into our circle, because T.A. will be my ally whenever the circle of friends acts crazy with each other. She's a civil lawyer. She does intellectual property. I kind of vaguely remember, like, intellectual property being on the bar, but that's <laughs> And I'm not saying Ron is insecure. She's older, you know, she can tell she works out and she takes pride in looking really good. But what an older woman don't want to see is a younger woman doing her job. Recess in the first degree, honey. And I'm saying the first degree, we're not gonna reconvene with this one. Girls, if y'all wanna get Vivian loose, I don't think a vibrator is the way to go, honey. I'm just saying, Vivian gets loose on two, four, maybe five drinks, you know? A vibrator? It's a massager. I want a big one, I want, I want a big one. I'm sorry. This looks like a vibrator to me. I'm gonna get me a man that knows how to vibrate. Vivian might have men at the front door, the back door, and the side door. I don't know. Vivian got a little roar still in her. Order in the court. Now, I'm not gonna hold Trina responsible for her actions because we all know she worked for Donald Trump and we know he ain't got no damn sense. But why would you come to Jolanda's Black Lives Matter event and then get into it with Rhonda, honey? I just got the sense that you didn't believe that any of these issues really exist for black people. How would you know? I couldn't even get a word out. Well, no, I, I think you made your views very clear, and, and that's what well, I'm, I'm a Republican and I'm the devil then. Thank, Thank you Katrina. so much. You have Katrina. a good Katrina. night, you and we will talk soon. Yes, are, are you good night. I just wanted to hold up a sign that says Black Lives Matter because one of y'all won't go make it out of that event and I think it was going to be Katrina. This week's friendship on trial, it was Juicy. Mama Bear versus Baby Bear. Vivian and T.A. I knew that wasn't going to work, honey. I hadn't been formally introduced to you, so that was rude. I'm Vivian King. T.A. Foley. I know T.A. Foley very well. Come on, Vivian. Has amnesia set in? What's really going on? Because you're one of the first people I meet when I get to Monique's house. You intruded in a conversation that you shouldn't have. And so I did find that I, that was offensive to me. You're young enough to be my daughter. I think you should speak to me in a more respectful manner. You said you like to respect conversations. No, this is what I want to tell I like, you. No, 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 I'm not. I don't, it, you, you, I can don't me, you can tell me I when I'm done. We don't have to, but you're, you can address it when I'm done, OK? Oof, you're a rude young lady. Miss T.A. is not trying to get information. Hopefully these ladies can work it out because I really like T.A. And I think Vivian can teach her a lot of things. But honey, y'all have to come to some mutual ground. Objection over rule. Who the hell wants to give Rhonda a gun? There's plenty of things Rhonda can have besides a gun to protect herself. Mace, a stun gun, I mean, hell, she can even get, um, hell, she can use Vivian's vibrator as a weapon. I need a gun. And I know you're against it. I can, I can see on your face you're thinking, <laughs> I don't want to do this. Everyone has a gun, especially when you're living in the South, especially when you're living in Texas. My friends all own their own guns. I think Vivian actually owns two guns. I mean, I'm the only one of the group who doesn't have her own gun. I don't trust Rhonda with a gun. I just don't. Let's keep the social conversation going. Every Thursday while you're watching Sisters-in-Law, make sure you use the hashtag S-I-L. Tune in next week for a brand new episode and check me out for Reality Rap every Friday right here on WeTV.com.